a bill of exchange first and foremost is drawn by the creditor by the person who has sold the goods when x sold goods to y it was x who made the bill of exchange but a promissory note would be made by y himself by the debtor by the person who bought the goods by the buyer bill of exchange contains an order to pay while a promissory note contains a promise to pay so x made an order he was ordering y to make a payment of rupees 20000 but in case of a promissory note y himself would make the promise to pay <clears throat> acceptance a bill of exchange becomes a valid bill of exchange only when it is accepted till such time that y accepts signs and accepts the bill of exchange it is not a valid bill of exchange but a promissory note is a promise to pay and therefore does not require any such acceptance a bill of exchange can be made payable to a bearer so it is possible that it is that the bill of exchange contains an order to make payment to a certain person to the order of the person or to the bearer of the instrument that means if there is an instruction to pay mr x or order of the or order of x or to the bearer of the instrument any person who bears or who carries this instrument can collect payment but a promissory note cannot be made payable to a bearer in a bill of exchange the drawer and the payee may be the same what does this mean who is the drawer in our example x drew x made the bill of exchange and it is possible that he says payment should be made to mr x in which case x is the drawer the payee is also x what is a pay person who receives payment is the pay but in case of a promissory note the drawer is the person who has to pay so that's why pay why is also a payer and not the pay so drawer and pay cannot be the same in case of a promissory note because the drawer promises to pay the maker of the promise note promises to pay and therefore he is the payer he cannot be the payee number of parties there could be three parties in case of a bill of exchange but in a promissory note there could be only two of course after a bill of exchange after a promissory note comes into existence both can be endorsed by the person who is entitled to receive payment notice on dishonor if a bill of exchange is dishonored the drawer of the bill the person who has drawn the bill must be given notice of its dishonor but in case of a promissory note this is not required because the person who made the promise who made the promissory note himself would not be paying or would not be honoring the 